Moving on, senators have unanimously passed a vote of confidence on the leadership of the President of the Senate, Senator Gotswil Akpabio. The assurances of loyalty to the leadership of Akpabio by the senators followed social media reports on Wednesday that some aggrieved senators from the North planned to impeach the Senate President. Raising a point of order on the floor of Thursday's plenary, a former leader of the Senate, Senator Yahya Abdullahi, drew the attention of his colleagues to a publication which claimed that northern senators were behind the impeachment plot against Senator Akpabio. The senator claimed that such an allegation was a breach of his constitutional rights as a citizen and lawmaker representing KB North. He said the allegation that northern senators were plotting Senator Akpabio's removal has put a dent on his reputation and integrity. Now, Senator Abdullahi said he has never conceived such ideas, adding that he had consulted his colleagues from the North and they expressed shock and disbelief that such had happened. A senior member of this chamber and also a senior member of the Northern Senators. And I can assure you that there has been no attempt, no attempt that I know of by any caucus or any group among the other senators to bring this code or make any attempt to challenge the legitimacy of your election or to undermine the work, the good work that we have been doing in this Senate. I consider my privilege breached because, Mr. President, I think whoever is bringing this issue want to bring damage among the interpersonal and official relationships among us, your constituents. Both Northern Senators and their colleagues from the South have been working in committees and in this Senate harmoniously. Therefore, any attempt to bring any kind of discord around regional lines in this institution is not going to augur well for either this institution or for this nation at large. Now, a cross section passed a confidence vote on the entire leadership of the 10th Senate. I think it is important for some of us that are probably been seen as the frontliners to say without consulting my friends, my colleagues from the north, that I move that will enforce a vote of confidence in both you, the Senate President, and the Deputy Senate President, and the entire leadership of the National Assembly in this regard. And I'm very positive that this is the way to go about it. Uh, anybody who wants to create any problem, going out can create it on himself, but not on the, our behalf. And uh, I, I tell you, once there is no crisis and it is established to blackmail, blacklist, and make it as if we are against the president of the Senate, it begins that question. So I move that on behalf of Northern Senators, that will vote a vote of confidence in your leadership, that of the Deputy Senate President, and the entire Senate leadership as we resolve to move as one, one people. I so move. I want to join my colleagues as a condemnation as moved by the single Senator Abdul Nuri that this Senate do vote a confidence vote in the leadership of the Senate and the entire leadership of the Senate under the Zubu Senator Gosu Lapabio, the common president of the Senate. I so second. In his remarks, Senator Gotsula Pabio expressed gratitude for the support from his colleagues and assured them of his intention to provide good leadership. Senator Ningi has moved a motion that a vote of confidence should be passed on the leadership of the Senate and seconded by the civil Senator Abbas. This is further amended by the minority leader of the Senate that it should be the entirety of the Senate and not just Northern Senators. And this has also been further seconded by the senior Senator 
Sami Musa, um, in a very humble way, I feel humbled, but I'm obligated to put the question. Those who support that this vote of confidence on the Senate leadership be carried, say aye. Those against, say nay. They are not here. The eyes have it. Let me thank uh, my distinguished senators on behalf of my brothers, the deputy senate president, and the leadership. And I assure you that the uh, the comradeship and the bond existing uh, between us in the 10th senate will continue. No amount of rumor, no social media will come here to break that bond. I thank you for this, and we are very humbled. Uh, the confidence is not misplaced. We will do our best in the coming months and in the coming years uh, to justify the confidence that you have placed in us. Thank you, and my almighty Allah bless each and every one of you. Amen.